Aujourd'hui, on travaille avec euh, la discipline de cheerleading. C'est une discipline euh, qu'on n'a pas ici au Ciel du Soleil. Typically, we have the sourcing level where we go out and we're actively seeking new talent, not necessarily for a specific role, but for the anticipated needs of all of our shows. Ça fait quelques années qu'on regarde l'évolution de cette discipline-là, qui a énormément de popularité, particulièrement aux États-Unis. Et on s'est toujours intéressé, entre autres, au fait qu'il y a une très, très grande différence morphologique entre les porteurs et les voltigeurs. Et l'utilisation de leur répertoire est très, très distinctif. Soccer sports, it's a connection of the two, three or even four gymnasts for athletes with dynamic movements. Cheerleading is more about explosive, fast, um, showing maybe the most difficult thing you can do. It's really rigid, really robotic. And now we try to do the same skills but with a little dance and art and more feelings. But I want to actually throw you as a challenge is to use the space more. Right? So it's not only vertical, but it's also lateral. Ce que j'ai remarqué dans leur compétition, ils dansent pas du tout. En effet, la chorégraphie n'est pas là. Here you connect elements and dancing and choreography all together. La séquence qu'on vient de travailler maintenant, je voulais vraiment chercher la fluidité du mouvement et aussi comment on puisse connecter les mouvements, les séquences entre eux d'une façon fluide et pas on voit pas la préparation. There's a range of motion and a range of skills that is just enough different from some of the other acrobatic disciplines. And all of that was really piquing our interest. What we're doing now is just letting them explore as much as possible and being able to pull and, and cull from their vocabulary something that we think could translate to the stage. This is really interesting because we never have been able to hire people from Chorilla. And this is the first experience for us. First experience for, I think, everywhere. It's very much what we would hope it would be, that they are able to work together, work outside of their typical stunt duos. We wanted to see that they would be able to crack open a little bit their shell and break free from some of the traditional cheer uh, training. That's sometimes a question of form, sometimes a little bit a question of technique, and certainly on the level of artistry, how can we encourage them to continue to explore uh, that artistic layer that will make it special.